Dear Sam, almost 11 years later, here we are. From the night we met, dancing badly on that light up dance floor and our first day at the bowling alley. I never would have believed I could fall in love with somebody as deeply as I have with you. My love for you has only ever grown stronger, day by day, year by year. It feels like we have already lived a lifetime together, yet at the same time feels like it's only just the beginning. You are everything I know and everything I love. You bring so much joy and silliness to the dullest of days and all the madness that life brings. You're there with a steady sense of calm to guide us through. Our most special times are not the most spectacular. They are our quiet and private moments, running with Nelly in the fields, dancing in the kitchen instead of washing up, and those morning kisses I only half remember when I'm not fully awake. You challenge me to see the world as you do, your incredible ability to see the very best in everyone, in every situation. I love your goofy sense of humour, your obsession with wood, trees and amazing music, even when it does lead us to the strangest of places. You are the most thoughtful person I know. I am so lucky and proud to soon be able to call you, call myself your wife. So let's go have our big lunch, bar the nap, continue the next exciting part of our story together and have a day we'll remember for the rest of our lives. I can't wait to get old, gray and wrinkly with you. I promise I will always be your best friend, your biggest supporter, to love you more and more each day and tightly hold your hand through whatever life brings our way. We're in this together forever. You are everything to me and I can't wait to call you my husband. All my love, the nearly Mrs. McLaren. Summer cold. The key to love. The key to love is understanding, the ability to comprehend not only the spoken word, but those unspoken gestures, the little things that say so much by themselves. The key to love is forgiveness, to accept each other's faults and pardon mistakes, without forgetting, but with remembering what you learn from them. The key to love is sharing, facing your good fortune as well as the bad. Together, both conquering problems, forever searching for ways to intensify your happiness. The key to love is giving without the thought of return, but with the hope of just a simple smile and by giving in, but never giving up. The key to love is respect, realizing that you are two separate people with different ideas, that you don't belong to each other, you belong with each other and share a mutual bond. The key to love is inside us all. It takes time and patience to unlock all the ingredients. It is the continual learning process that demands a lot of work, but the rewards are more than worth the effort. And that is the key to love. Welcome to you all on this lovely day, to this ancient and holy place. We've come together, families and friends, to witness Carla and Sam as they exchange their vows of marriage. Today we share with Carla and Sam their delight in finding love with each other, and we support their decision to be together from now until the end of time. Sam, I give you this ring as a sign of our marriage. With my body, I honour you. All that I am, I give to you. And all that I have, I share with you. In the presence of God and before this congregation, Sam and Carla have given their consent and made their marriage vows to each other. They've declared their marriage by the joining of hands and by the giving and receiving of rings. I therefore proclaim that they are husband and wife. And to those whom God has joined together, let no one put asunder. And Carla, you may kiss the bridegroom.
I know it's not traditional for the bride to stand up and say a speech, but I haven't been nicknamed Little Sharon for a reason. <laughs> um, I couldn't let this day go by without getting my word in as well. <laughs> so so. To Sam, my husband. <laughs> I wanted to pinch that. <laughs> I was surprised to see in church today that you weren't waiting for me in a four-piece matching denim suit. <laughs> Despite threatening to for the last few years. A lot of you will know his serious love of wearing as much denim as possible. <laughs> but you might not realise how often he tries to get me to coordinate with him when we go out. And as today is a very special day, and now that most of the formalities and the photographs are out of the way, I've got something um, that I thought you'd make you feel a little bit more you in. <laughs> We're now finally celebrating the marriage of Carla and Sam to be able to share their special day that they've both been planning for so long now. The proposal was at least 10 years ago, so it really has been a true labour of love. Sam, welcome to the Madhouse, officially now. In fairness, as you and Carla have made it this far, I know you have a true friend and soulmate in Carla. And other than perhaps investing in a few pairs of earplugs, Sam, I think you have everything you both need in each other to begin this next chapter of your lives and have a wonderful life together. Sam, I wish you good luck and Godspeed and a lot of patience. <laughs> um, it was tough postponing this wedding last year, um, but it wouldn't have been the same without you all here. Uh, I've stayed pretty calm and cool till this point. Um, you all play an important part in our lives, and we're so happy to have you here uh, on our special day. <laughs> I can't believe we've been together nearly 11 years. I still remember the day I saw you at the school leavers do. <laughs> um, from the other side of the room, but I didn't have the courage to come up and talk to you. Lo and behold, a few months later, you turned up at the restaurant I worked in. Not as a customer, but as the pot washer, <laughs> dressed in your best scruffs. After a party and a kiss, went out on our first date, which still to this day is the most ideal date 
bowling and a McFlurry. You can't go wrong. <laughs> Um, and finally, they say a guitar gets better with age, so I'm hoping that works for us too. But in all seriousness, Carla really is amazing. Um, she's re beautiful, ridiculously talented, full of laughter and full of love. <laughs> She'll always have your back. We've had an amazing 11 years together, and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. Here's to the most amazing bride I could ever ask for. Could all please be upstanding? Takala McLaren. Yeah.